Landing at your location. <laughs> We're dead. This is not funny. This is not funny. Hello, hello, welcome, or baby, welcome back to part three. I hope you all are great. Um, let's jump right into the mission that we left off last time. Uh, we are still fighting in the Vega system, and hopefully we will be able to hold the oncoming store. Commander, a priority alert just came in. Chusa Olesko's unit has been ambushed by Snort's irregulars in the Bandy Wastes, northeast of New Egypt. His landsmates are reporting Olesko's down and unresponsive. The fifth never leaves the man behind. We ain't gonna start now. We need to get Olesko strapped to a medivac, VTOL, and dust him out. Get in the fight, otherwise the Chusa is a goner. Move fast, Commander. Olesko's counting on you. Uh, the biggest problem in these missions yet was the really, really slow times or like short times for repairs in between the mission. Um, I'm kind of strapped mech wise, but uh, let's see how this is going. I mean, yeah. um, I'm gonna go full salvage again. I already got 1 million damage coverage in this campaign for all of the missions. The base payout also is pretty okay. So, salvage is the most juicy thing, in my opinion. All right, let's see what I can even feel because most of the mechs are still in the repair bay. Um, some of them hopefully might get ready, like the Jagger mech. I don't think I will be able to feed 300 tons, to be fully honest here. It looks bad. Which one could get ready? Let me think. Where's the Grand Dragon? Oh, Grand Dragon. Where is it? Did I already put it in? No. Huh? Where's my Grand Dragon? Ah, there. <laughs> Sorry, I'm blind. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. You know what? Sink. Yes, King Crab. That looks pretty solid. Need to get rid of five tons, though. Hmm. I think I'm gonna take the Victor over the Dragon Mac. Jaeger mech. I'm sorry, it's not Mick Jagger's mech. <laughs> uh, yeah, probably the Blackjack. I mean, it's better than the Panther. And I don't have any substitute for these guys, so I really hate to not be piloting that thing myself, to be honest. Looks way too versatile to let it get handled by a rookie, so to speak. <laughs> Even though he has 59 maximum. Okay, let's go. Commander, Chusa Lesko's lance is in a world of hurt. They're raining down fire. Chusa took an effective hit. He requires an immediate medevac. I'm almost there. You support element. I'm running. Up to their location and draw in the slowest manner possible. Them. I mean, the Annihilator tech is still slower, only has 32 max speed, I think. But as it's a walking fire station, that, that's okay. <laughs> Do we already see enemies? No. I think, yeah, the groups are okay, I already piloted that thing. And we got enemy artillery, I really dislike that. Hopefully, I'm not going to take too much damage again. Uh, uh. Almost, almost. That was pretty bad. But for the small targets, the AI is perfectly set up to deal with. All units, keep your goddamn heads up! Those artillery impacts are covering every inch of the target area. Let's go over there. The two sides unresponsive. We needed to clear those spotters so we can get them out of here. They're hitting us with tech we've never faced before. So watch yourself. Let's try to quickly rush clear down out, those Commander. artillery spots. Alesco's boys will remain with him as a security shield. And then... They'll be sitting ducks, so if you want to earn a few extra bags, 
Make sure the whole lance makes it through. Are you kidding me? They got light mechs. The whole lance is never gonna make it through. Hate to be saying that, but let's be real here. Okay, I gotta change the mech. That one is also pretty slow. Let's not take the black track. Let's take the grand dragon. Go, baby boy! My god, this thing is. Oh, 81. I wasn't expecting that. This thing is awesome! I'm loving you already, baby. Holy shit. I'm just not, like, exactly sure do I have to destroy these? Oh! Where are you coming from? Okay. I guess I was to kill some mechs at some spots. Kind of messed that up. Could you guys please shoot him? Oh, the sinks. Nice. I'm not sure how they pack like this kind of armor, weaponry, and speed in 60 tons, but um, let's just pretend this is uh, possible. <laughs> in the Metal Tech universe. It's a hell of a fun mech, but I don't think this uh, should be existing, to be fully honest. You are quite sketchy, my boy. Right. I mean, we could just say it's Dalek tech, you know. Pretend like... Yeah. I would love to have more fighting in the water, because you don't overheat, which is pretty awesome. Ah, uh, sorry the alarm on my phone just went off. I hope you didn't hear that. Okay, I'm just to eliminate enemy forces at these locations. I feel like the Grand Drag is gonna get an insane beating in this mission. It's just too fast and always in first. Oh my god, that was so bad. Please let me hit him. Ah, god. There we go. Ah, oh, shouldn't have shot the laser. <laughs> this is so bad. Get that little guy. Thank you. Uh, this is uh, very rough. I'm taking way too much damage again, especially on the Grand Drag. Sad thing is, if, if I'm controlling it myself, it will get even hammered worse. So maybe... Considering... Just actually send it somewhere. Where it doesn't engage in combat directly. Didn't I finish that other location already? Maybe I missed some targets. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. This is confusing. What have I done wrong in that location? Did I miss something? Holding at your waypoint. Hey, you just stay there. You're already way too much damage. This is 
screw the rest, and let's get our boy out of there. Stop screwing around. Finish them. I'm so confused. <laughs> what is even going on here? There's nothing left in this location, right? Why was it locked again? Some tank hiding somewhere. I don't get it. There is nothing here. Yeah, after wasting that time, let me quickly, I guess, jump to that location. Over there. Some planes coming in, but that's nothing serious. I'm kind of afraid getting the Grand Dragon back into the fight, but I need all the firepower I can get still. Come on, buddy. Don't be so shy. Not sure if I can go up. Let's try to stompity stomp. Not enough stompy. On the commander's target. Where did you come from? Ah, so close. Build up on the sins. So bad. We need to pull our boy out of the fray. I hope it gets a little bit better with the second double heat sink, but you cleared them out. maybe it's still pushing. not enough. And yet again they went for the grand track, like. which is really bad. Time's against us. Push forward. Area secure. We mopped them all up. Stand by. Medivac chopper inbound. Medics will get the Chusa back up and running. We're made of granite in the fifth, and we never leave a man behind. You guys were not much of help, to be fully honest. Hopefully my Grand Dragon didn't get any parts destroyed. But it didn't sound like that. Normally they would communicate that, I think. This is concerning. I'm in really, really bad shape here. Ah, uh, let's see. I mean, obviously, I would love to take the part. I mean, yeah, that's what I did this for, but I'm really getting doubts on, on my tactics here with basically having no time to even put those parts into any mix. I would I'm definitely going to take that one. I love me a Thunderbolt, especially the SS edition. This is very strong, in my opinion. I like those weapon layouts. As a German, I probably should say the edition out too loud if I say about it, but uh, yeah, too late now. Let's quickly set that bad boy up, repair it before I forget that again. Um, we don't want the flamer. We also take this one out and this one out. Don't like the SRM. We're gonna go a little bit. Bigger was actually thinking uh, LAM 15 is a little bit too much. Um, let's get 
the ammo. That's 44 shots. Yeah, that's enough. Don't want the small energy. We give it the large laser instead of the PPC. And one more heat sink. It loses a little firepower like that, but I feel it's getting more sustainable in 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 you know it's more flexible. Two long range weapons. Some medium lasers to brawl with, which I probably should switch out to the better version. Yeah. Enough changes otherwise. Oh 80 days or what? Ay Probably also won't use that one in this campaign. <laughs> Let's see, this one, four days, might be actually one day too much, let's see, that one gets a full repair, I'm actually thinking partial repair for that bad boy, I want to repair this one, whole, five days, okay, let's have a look at the next mission and then I'll see if I can repair them fully. I got good news and bad news, Commander. Early signs point to Shusa Olesko's making a full recovery. He will not be able... He will... He will not be in the seat of a mech anytime soon, but he really saved his ass out there. The bad news is my men are dropping like flies. I'm not offering up more of my boys to the slaughter. I'm pulling my men out of here while we still have a pull. Jojo Nordica will remain here in Vega with the 14th, but we need to burn out and regroup. That's the only way we are gonna keep combat power and be of any use to the fight moving forward. The lions and snorts a regular smell blood in the water. They are gonna throw everything at us to try and knock us out of the game for good. I need you to help us punch our ticket out of here. Our men have been loaded up in three Union dropships that will get us out of Dodge. Please let them be present and fully weaponized. <laughs> it's on you to shield three Union dropships and ensure they launch out. You won't be in this alone. Chocho has set a full complement of 14th Legion units to fight alongside you. It's a big task, big ask, Commander, but I got faith you will get the job done. Chocho Nordica and I will update the status of the launches as they unfold. Leave it all out there, Commander. The fate of me and my men is in your hands. Okay, this sounds like maybe the last mission in the Vega system, but let's see. Shield the withdrawal of the three Union dropship against Snorts, Irregulars, and Alliance forces to ensure the 5th Amphidian burn out safely I am addicted to salvage even though I'm doubting my choices at this point <laughs> six days okay 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 you get a full repair and you get a full repair and then actually let's have a quick look up here catapult king crab big door warhammer blackjack kintaro yeah, got the warhammer that gets ready. I think this one, right? Yes. Um, we don't want the blackjack. Kintaro is getting ready. What else was it? Hold on. Kind of confused here. Ah. Did I already skip the days? No. The blackjack, the warhammer, the victor. Okay, crap. Catapult, the catapult. That's that's what I was looking for. That bad boy. Right. Yep, looks good. I think, well, not perfect looking at you, my buddy. But um, it's the best I can do. Let's drop in there. Get our mates out. Did I miss anything? Centurion. Check out Kentaro. No, oh, none of the real bad boys is ready. We've reached a decisive point, Commander. Ensure the 5th depart Vega safely. The Alliance is sending enough firepower to ensure that doesn't happen. You and the 14th Legion will form a defensive shield Ooh, around each Union dropship as they launch. Prevent the Lyran Guard from breaking through. But the Union dropship is firing, which I appreciate. It's a lot on your shoulders, Commander. But I got faith you could punch our ticket out of here. Or was it just a small dropship? Target destroyed! Eh. 
could you please not be right above me? It makes it really hard to shoot you down. Uh, probably should be taking that one out first. And this one. A flea. Oh my god. Ha! I actually hit it. Who would have thought that? So hard to hit the fleas with an AC-20. <laughs> Gotta pre-aim a lot. And even then, sometimes you just don't hit them at all. Go for the blackjack, guys. I'm gonna take that Wolverine out for a show. Oh, damn, you shoot me. Didn't your toaster parents teach you any manners? Crap, I should have taken out that partisan first. Probably did way too much damage. God, I hate when they come around the corner. You cannot really react in time. Even though with my brawler setup from the King Crab, I mean, should be good with this. Still dislike it. Don't want to shoot the left gun. Probably would have hit my own guy. Why is everybody shooting at my guys? You see, the blue guys, they are really evil. You should shoot these people. Probably should have checked on that Kentaro first. Oh my god, there's so many coming. Ah, I should have overwritten the shit Now let's just try to take only the AC-20 before I cool down a bit. I hate arid surroundings. Can we fight on a nice, cozy ice planet? Okay, the dropship doesn't seem to be firing, that was my bad. It was just the landing ship that actually shot a bit. But so far so good, we didn't take too much damage. And this one is lifting up. Nice. That vibration. <laughs> Can't aim. Holy hell. Gotta get some distance to that dropship. It's insane. Oh, that's another dropship. I didn't even realize that. I'm so confused. They are not even going for the dropship. Something is very fishy. <laughs> if you want to stop the dropship from actually lifting off, why aren't you shooting the dropship? At least it's a not too hardcore crap version. There's this other one with pulse lasers that's really scary. Ah, we are holding up O cage, not great, but O cage. Another wave of enemy max drop. I'm actually thinking about getting some distance to the battlefield there. Yeah. 
One more shot. Ah, another Kintaro. They are sending in the good stuff for sure. Oh, he's already behind me. I got him as a knock. Sister. I dislike what is happening here. But still holding up of cage. Oh my god, there's so many. Uh, I had to do that. If there's one shot missing, they're over. Uh, the emergency shutdown is not too bad. We got one more minute, 50 seconds, but there should be a third dropship also. Which is making me curious. Huh? Who the fuck designed this? There's <laughs> so much bad stuff happening. Yeah! Right into the kisser. Right into the kisser. Ah. Oh my god. That was bad. Ammo low? Oh, I don't like that sound. Getting hammered way heavily. Oh my god, let's turn around a bit. This is way too much damage. Fuck, my back is also not holding up to green. Guys, you gotta step it up, please. Can't do everything. Oh my god, I'm only seven shots left. Once this thing is out of ammo, it's not good anymore. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, even he survived. <laughs> Stalker. Okay, this is uh This is insanity. Kill the king crab? No, okay, at least. Something's still okay. Are they not even shooting him? Oh my god. Blue guys are just running by that stalker. I lost way more than one million in repairs. And we still got two freaking minutes to go. This is fucking insane. And they didn't do anything to this guy. Oh my god. Sometimes the AI in this game is so bad. Like the enemy AI, pretty good. Keeps hitting you, ins insanely hammering you, but your guys. You're Oh, I, I don't feel like fighting today, sir. Why would we do that? That is insanity. Lance, it's Oscar Mike. I'm so effed after this. I will have long recovery time. Uh, let's check that. Oh, it's so bad. That one is also out of everything, basically. Station, Commander. Uh. Enemy ship landing at your location. <laughs> We're dead. This is not funny. This is not funny, and I'm dead. This mission is insane.
Okay, I see. My guys are literally acting like fucking muppets. Running right into an atlas and then instead of getting punched by it. I might have to replay this one. What the F though? Still good. Still got that very heavily armed Victor here. <laughs> Seven seconds to go. Still got they are not even shooting the fucking. Obviously, options. the environment down here is all soft. The, so the ceiling's silly. soft, the floor is soft, the walls are soft. Uh, and this mission is a little bit air scrap is soft. Design. Yay. You gave us a fighting chance, Commander. For what it's worth. I probably have to redo that. We've reached a decisive point, Commander. Ensure the 5th depart Vega safely. The Alliance is sending enough firepower to ensure that doesn't happen. You and the 14th Legion will form a defensive shield around each Union dropship as they launch. Prevent the Lyran Guard from breaking through, whatever it takes. Okay, I'm trying to be fully so transparent here. This Commander. is the second time I'm playing this. Um, this mission is sheer insanity. Also, the whole mission seems... What I realized at the end of the mission when I got completely wiped out towards the end. Uh, this mission seems to be a ruse, actually. The enemy doesn't give a freaking jackass about those dropships. The only thing the enemy is going for is me. My little bunch of mechs. So I'm just gonna hunker down in this corner because another problem is the AI pilots are mostly useless in this territory because they seem to be bunging out a lot and like get stuck at rocks and shit like that and you're basically fighting numerous enemy forces most of the time completely alone if you just run in and run and gun basically. So I'm gonna try to cheese it a little bit, stay on the back area let enemy mechs come towards me if they dare to do so and hopefully like that the AI will also be not completely useless and I don't give a rat's ass if these guys die because they were doing jackass last time when I got slaughtered I lost everything last time really everything three pilots dead three mechs lost the last mech surviving was the Victor with literally no weapons and no equipment at all left Moving into formation. so yeah um my recommendation for this mission is uh, fuck it. <laughs> Move to the commander. This is uh, not fun. This is uh, just, uh, I mean, even in this location there will be enemies very soon surrounding me from all angles as there were dropships literally coming right on top of my head during the last mission with Atlas and other. In see? See? That's what I mean. The dropship is unprotected, don't give a red sign. The only thing they care about is going for me. So nah, I'm not having that. Because I really need to save up my ammo on the AC-20. Last time I ran out very quickly, mid-mission. It's just too many targets. See, everyone is just going for the player mech. And as soon as I switch to another mech, they immediately go for that one. It's so hilarious. We're heading that way, sir. Target destroyed. Following your lead, Commander. Warhammer. Sending in more 14th support units. See? Because they get replenished, I ain't. They are, by the way, the worst support you can get. <laughs> I know it sounds a little bit cranky, but it's just too insane. The stuff that was happening last time really made me a little bit baffled. Left me a little bit baffled. 
Because see, now this one is lifting off and forces, enemy forces will come very close to me anyhow. And when the last one is dropping, it's basically all assault max and heavies that they are. And, and the good ones, not like some crappy stuff. With stuff like chargers or something, no, 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 it's all Atlas and, and, and I don't know, Banshees and, and all that shit is way too large rent. And especially when they already get dropped to you. I mean, I know, I know, this is bad. I'm not showing much of the mission. But maybe I'm just gonna leave the part where I'm getting completely wrecked. Enemy advancing on the perimeter. Contact imminent. Like make a little bad idea, good idea about this. We can make you flip through. Be advised. Additional hostile elements converging on target area. Ah. It's fine. Trust me, it's fine. Those dropships, they are very fine. <laughs> Yeah, these waves already are getting very harsh. I'm actually gonna try get a little cover in between these rocks. The prospect of survivability looks grim, Commander. But we've fought through die rods many times before. I hate to be doing it like this, really, trust me guys, but I don't see me being able to finish this regularly. Right, not in a healthy state. You might get lucky and like have a little bit better run, but I nah, nah, nah. You can't. You can't. <laughs> I don't think you can if you just go in brawling. I mean, it's not my problem that the mission is so badly designed, they are not even attacking the objectives you, in theory, would have to defend. They won't be around much longer. Reporting damage. You still got a lot to do with the last five minutes defend this thing. And again, very happy to do this mission in a healthy state. They are shooting still. <laughs> it's kind of funny even to see this like unfolding from a distance and just thinking to you, yeah, I'm getting paid anyhow. But then again, as mentioned before, this is uh, far from being over. The last wave will be dropping right next to me. Destroyed. Target destroyed. Incoming 
And there we go. Soon to be coming. Six, Commander. I wonder if he's still fighting down there. Here we go. This one is bad. Enemy mech detected. Lance target received. This is just the beginning. There is more to come very soonish. To get closer to that archer. Some reason. The last wave doesn't seem to have been dropped yet. Oh, there they come. There they are coming. I echo those sentiments, Commander. There can still be victory and retreat. Your contributions will be invaluable in the conflicts to come. Sorry, no candle want to survive. I'm sorry for being this lame in this mission, but last time I just got hammered so badly that I thought I had to cheese it. But maybe if I just would have like participated more on the offside of the battlefield instead of going in brawling. Yeah. Like mentioned earlier, I'm not too proud I'm not too proud of myself on this one. I think I'm going to take another Thunderbolt. I like these little bad boys. Or maybe let's see what equipment does. Wow. It's actually pretty okay space equipment. Yeah, we have to place a lot. Let's maybe take the Warhammer. I think the Thunderbolt is overall a better mech than the Warhammer, but can't argue with taking that equipment. This one wouldn't even need much repairs in theory. Hmm. No, no, I want to have some equipment. I really feel bad after this mission, I don't know. 
Why are you making me feel sad, game? Uh, let's take another asylum. That was a damn fine job, Commander. If not for you, the fist would be dust particles. Yeah, I, I <clears throat> fought intensely. You fought like one of us out there. I would take you under my command any day. My last act as your CEO, I'm offering you up some serious combat bonuses. God knows you earned them. Make sure you rest and repair up. I know your contract is ongoing, so you need any R&R &R you can get. Just remember what I told you. Don't let the combined handcuff you to them forever. Good luck. So, let's have a quick look at the Mac Warrior we got here. Okay, he's not too great. Yeah, I'm sorry, guy. Uh, we got some more money. I think I'm gonna get that Cicada just to fulfill that mission. Because getting these guys is pretty harsh sometimes. Uh, drop the ward. There we go. Nothing too great here, but. I mean, I could have, like, stripped it before I put it in, but there was not too much great equipment on that mech. Um, and the longbow is also still something we would really like to have. Let's get it now. I'm gonna fly over equipment, I think, when I did another quick... Oh, I never get that. It's still way too expensive, but at this point, it shouldn't be too bad. Whew. Let's repair all of them. Hmm. Probably should check if I can do any better weapons at this stage. Get a little bit more powerful, basically. Don't have any good substitute for the other large pools, sadly. And uh, the rest is okay. And the Victor is really just an emergency mech, so to speak, so I'm not gonna give it too much love here. This one is as good as it can get for now. And the rest is basically already repairing. Let's correctly reset up this bad boy. I think I'm gonna take this stuff out for more armor. Basically, like to be tanky in the front, a little less, a bit more in the back. Let's get the legs set up. Maybe a little less on the legs. At least get to the needed weight again. Yeah, uh, not great, but it will do. Let's quickly switch up that SRM6 for something better. PPCs are okay, probably. Do I still have better lasers? No, okay, my bad. So I might still have some. Yeah. The number of heat sinks is not too great. Um, leave them just. Otherwise, the repair will take too long. Oh, insufficient seabirds. That's something I really dislike to see. Huh. Okay. That was some time wasted. Hold on. Can I just sell stuff off? From here. That's something I never really have tried before. Okay. And yeah, then sadly I have to do all of that again. Let's get rid of some jump jets. Oh, not purchase. 
Oh my god, that was... Shit. <laughs> How to F yourself in the best way. You just sort like... <laughs> uh, let's send out the equipment overall a little bit, yeah. Let's see stuff that we not necessarily need. Probably not gonna use this one. Low level flame are also not needed. Those I will never use. That one. A uh, few. Let's get rid of the regular machine guns. Don't need that many light lasers or small lasers. Uh, I like the streak, but let's be honest here. In that quality grade, I will not be using it. Okay. Hopefully, this should be enough for any needed repairs now. And to not get bankrupt during the next travel. Okay. Okay. I think that's pretty much how I left. Yeah. Oh, hold on. I also need 2.7 million in seven days. Let's sell off the mech. Hold on. Uh, I think I want to keep the Panther for certain. Reasons the blackjack dots not my favorite mech. So let's just sell that one off to make sure we got that money needed. Yeah, I would love to move some more mechs in the cold storage, but then again, it's way too risky. I need all of or might need all of them in battle. Okay, let's see. We are departing to a new system, as it seems. Let's get some more missions here. Oh, I just saw them. That's very... Ah, very disappointing. <laughs> okay, okay. Hopefully that 69 days is that two money cycles, or is that one money cycle? Right. 90 days? Was it 90 days between maintenance? Oh my god. I'm scared. <laughs> there you go. Commander, I am pleased to speak to you once again. I was not sure you would remain in One Piece Defending Vega, but here you are. It is clear you are a survivor. Like the Combine itself, we need all the will to survive that we can, but the Combine survival is still very much in doubt. To that end, Theodore Kurita has devised a counteroffensive to try and turn the tide of this conflict. The goal is simple plunge deep into regions of the Commonwealth and Federated Suns and create enough of a stir that Hansa Davian is forced to call his men away from the Combine and send them back home. We have already dispatched units to accomplish this. Head to the system's jump point. You will join Li Chang, commander of the Force Arkab Legion inside Old Horse. From there, you will raid the Commonwealth world as they have done to us. Good luck, Commander. I have no doubt you will continue to acquit yourself well. We are departing from Vega. The Fedcom invasion extracts a heavy toll. Systems slip through our grasp as the enemy seeks to break our will, offering only death and destruction. A bold move is needed to prevent annihilation. To that end, Conray Kurita has devised a counter-strike for the ages in an effort to reshape our fortunes. A tactical gambit that could see the Combine snatch victory from the clutches of defeat. The forward deployed are the tip of the sword. These raiding units will plunge deep into the home regions of the Federated Sons and Lyran Commonwealth. We must force our adversary to react. This is our only chance to weather the storm. The 4th Arkab Legion will gather inside the Althouse system, in attack range of Arcturus. 
From there, this daring counter-offensive will get underway. Strike hard, Raiders. I wish you good fortune. The fate of the Combine hangs in the balance. Yet again, I have to say, they nailed the cutscenes. For sure. Okay, we are not bankrupt yet. That is very good. Oh, there's some nice stuff here, as it seems, in the Arcturus system. No pilots to hire. Actually, let's save some more money. Let's get rid of that one. Hopefully, we are not losing any pilots throughout the campaign. Nothing interesting here. Nothing interesting, really. I mean, the Beagle Active Corp is not bad. But then I feel again it doesn't really work that well against AI opponents. <laughs> okay. And that sounds interesting. I mean, the assassin contract is always hard to be doing. As it's so random if you even meet the smacks. Repair wise, we look gorgeous at this point. And that's where I'm going to end this episode. I hope you enjoyed. Very sorry, I kind of cheese my way through the last mission on Vega because it was uh, a bit batshit crazy and I feel like I didn't have the right max left to take the oncoming slot or the ongoing onslaught yeah you are allowed to diss me in the comments for this obviously I, I'm respecting that I'm not too proud of myself here and I take any any you know critique towards this as serious and understandable <laughs> i hope you have a great day hope to have you back for another episode see you soon and goodbye